Hi, I'm Vanessa Ellison. I have a Bachelor of Arts from the Mayborn School of Journalism. I double minored in Spanish and social science. I also have a Master of Science in International Sustainable Tourism from UNT and Catia in Turialva, Costa Rica, and that is a College of Merchandise and Hospitality and Tourism program. I am now currently the Education Coordinator for the City of Denton Parks and Rec Department, Beautification, Education, and Event Specialist. When I started at UNT, my plan was to be a news anchor. Um, that plan has changed in a way for the city of Denton. I am a news anchor for Denton Television, so I still get to use my journalism degree quite frequently, but um, I work now in sustainability as well, so it did change a bit. If I could give one small pearl of wisdom, it would be get an internship intern or shadow as much as you can so that you can get experience to see if you actually like the field that you're going into. In my undergraduate degree, I interned at WFAA Channel 8. I covered two homicides my first week and I learned very quickly that I did not want to be in the news industry. Unfortunately, I had one um, semester left before I graduated. So I was thinking, what should I do? What should I do? And I was looking around campus and I saw the MIST program the Master of Science in International Sustainable Tourism, and I was able to go in and speak with um, the advisors there and get enrolled for the following year for my master's. And that program actually really helped me with my current job in sustainability. Um, the reason why is because I got to study internationally and I studied um, not only in Costa Rica, but in Cuba and Japan. And I also got to live in those places. And so learning about different cultures and um, just different ways of living and lifestyles really helped me with my current position with working with the community. I found my current job in kind of a twofold way. I was working for a different company. I was a community business development manager for Barnes & Noble. And throughout that time, I had been networking and meeting people that worked with the city while I was handling their accounts. Someone that I met advised me to apply for this job that worked there. They felt that I would be a good fit. And so I went online to the City of Denton Careers um, website and I applied and I was able to get through all three interviews and make it. At my current job, I was asked a question that is not necessarily tough, but I gave a very awkward answer. The question was, how do people describe you? And I couldn't think of anything. And so I said, like glitter. And they were like, what? Um, and I just explained how glitter is kind of like always shiny. You see it, even if you try to get rid of it, it's there. Um, and I just kind of described myself like that. I'm one of those people that you don't forget or that you'll miss um, if you're around me. And so I just kind of said that and I thought it was so awkward. And when I got hired on, they called me glitter. They were like, that is the coolest answer we've ever heard. And they would tell the story to anyone that will listen. And so now that's just the normal answer for me. I just go with glitter. The Career Center has helped me in the past with my resume, with interviews, um, but also currently, um, I still send things to the Career Center to be looked at. You always wanna update your resume and make sure that you're adding on new skills and things that you learn. And I would say like a month ago, I sent my resume into the Career Center just to have a professional look over it and make sure it was cleaned and polished. 